Hello everybody, this is Kayanda the Smart Home and my name is Ali Reza. In today's video, I have Sonoff ZigBee Wireless Switch, SNZB01. I will have a look at it, set it up to see how it works. Using this device, you can control up to three devices or run scenes. Using ZigBee devices, a hub is necessary. In this video, I use Son of ZigBee Bridge as a hub. If you do not know how to use a ZigBee Bridge, the Son of One, watch this video. Let's start. Before that, I thank Sepermonavar Group and Artman Company for supporting me to make this video. Let's begin with unboxing Son of ZigBee Switch. In the box, we have the wireless switch. One press, double press, long press. We have quick manual. Product qualification. And 3M adhesive tape for mounting the device. For installing the device, tear off the protective film of the 3M adhesive and stick the device on the desired area if you want to have it in a fixed place. Do not install the device on metal surface, otherwise it will affect the wireless communication distance. In order to pair this device with Evelink app, Remove the back cover. Pull out the battery installation sheet. Here we have reset button and LED indicator. In order to enter the device into pairing mode, the reset button must be pressed and hold for five seconds until the LED indicator flashes three times. I have already paired a Zigbee bridge with Evelink app. If you want to know how to do it, watch this video. OK, access Evelink app, select the bridge that you want to connect. Tap on the add to add the sub device. Then long press the reset button until the LED flashes three times. For five seconds. Wait till pairing is done. Pairing the device, put it as close to the Zigbee bridge as you can. As you see on the screen of Evelink app, one device is found. I click on Next. The switch is paired with Evelink app. While putting the cover in its place, pay attention to these signs. They must be opposite of each other. Now the device is paired with Evelink app and you can use it by one click, double click, and long press. The device is paired with Evelink app, but how to use it? You should create scenes in order to use this device. Let's see how. On the Evelink app, 
the device is added as switch I tap on the switch you can bind camera to it we have the log of the device we have the battery status at the top right corner of the screen in Evelink app you will get a notification of low battery level when the battery life gets 10% remaining on Evelink app navigate to scenes page tap on add in if section tap on add to select the wireless switch I select a smart device select switch here we can choose the scene is tricked by one click double clicked or long pressed I choose clicked then tap on save in then section I tap on add a smart device I select light here we can choose to reverse turn it to on or set it to off I select reverse then tap on save at the bottom of the screen effective period is 24 hours I tap on it disable it I want to have the scene every day then tap on save again I tap on save in this page I set a name for it control light then tap on save scene is created I navigate to home page light is set to off one click of the wireless switch the zigbee switch is turned to on it is set to off you can control other devices as like as Wi-Fi devices in this video I have Wi-Fi wall plug let's create a scene to control it I navigate to scene tap on plus I select or let's say I tap on add in if section tap on a smart device select switch this time I choose double clicked tap on save in then section I tap on add a smart devices or you can select delay if you want to run your scene with delay I select a smart device choose wall plug again reverse then tap on save effective period by default is 24 hours I disable it and in repeat section you can choose days of the week I select all the days then tap on save again tap on save set a name for it do not forget to save your scene we have two scenes at the moment they are enabled we can disable them or enable them again let's test the device I click the switch twice or let's say double click the wall plug is turned on and you can see on the Evelink app again I double click the smart switch it is off let's test the long press navigate to scenes tap on plus at the top right corner of the screen in if section I tap on add then tap on a smart device select switch then choose long press click save 
indent section I tap on add select delay this time for example 5 seconds tap on save again indent section I tap on plus select a smart device this time I select wall plug choose off then save let's add another device you can control several devices using wireless switch I tap on plus select a smart device select light choose off then save it okay I save the scene set a name for it all lights off save we have created three scenes all of them are enabled wall plug and light are off one click wall switch in wall switch is set to on double click wall plug is set to on long press after five seconds both devices are set to off this is how you can use Sonoff wireless switch you can easily delete the device by long pressing the reset button for five seconds until the LED indicator flashes three times. Another way of deleting or removing the Zigbee device from Zigbee Bridge is navigating to Zigbee Bridge on Evelink app. Select the device. In this video, I select switch. In this page, you can see that we have the log of the device tap on three dots at the top right corner of the screen by tapping on delete device this device will be removed from Zigbee bridge confirm thank you for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe my channel if you haven't done already you can support me by buying me a coffee I'll see you in the next video